Hey guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going luxury shopping with Madame MM Style Icon. She is currently in Las Vegas and I'm super excited. I'm filming my intro right now and she's going to be here in like 5 minutes to pick me up. We are going Dior, we're going Versace, um, maybe Van Cleef, I'm not too sure yet, but we'll be going around to a few different kind of boutiques and I'm going to film and show you guys what we do and what we look at and overall I'm just so so excited. I cannot wait to see her. We are also getting another friendship bracelet so I'm very very excited about that and we're also going to be filming a food review video. We are having brunch at Wynn Buffet so make sure to subscribe to our other channel Trish Eason Travels and Hangry Hubster. I will link it down below. If you guys are new to my channel, please subscribe and follow me on Instagram. I also want to let you guys know that I'm currently having a Dior giveaway. I'll link that video down below if you guys want to enter. So let's head to Madame's car. So we stopped by VCA first. However, we couldn't go inside because they were in full capacity. But we just stopped by and my essay Maya gave us some red envelopes. So thank you and happy Lunar New Year. We just got out of VCA. We got some red envelopes. And now we are heading over to the Shop of Crystals. We're currently at the wind if anybody is wondering. Uh, we're gonna go to Versace now and then Dior and just shop around. So we're going to take you guys with us. Don't forget to subscribe to my best friend, Madame MM Star Icon. Please support her. Support my channel. Thank you. You guys, we are at Crystals now. We're heading to Versace first, and then we're gonna go Dior. And then, do you want to go Chanel too? Or? Yeah. Chanel. Yeah. After that, Chanel. Oh, yes. Bulgari and Burberry <laughs> everywhere. So Versace first. Now we are in Versace and I was just kind of browsing around. They put some of their bikinis out and I really love Versace bikinis. They're really comfortable and I guess this is like a sarong or like a scarf but you can really use it for whatever you want. A really pretty skirt. They also have Versace like sports bra and it looks so comfortable even some leggings and we have some beach tote bags like denim and canvas. The beige one is really nice. I love the denim one as well. And then my essay, Jesse, he showed us some of the fragrances. So my boyfriend, he uses Versace cologne and I wanted to check it out and see how it smells. And they're like collection that they only carry in the boutiques. So I think that's really cool. And then here is my essay, Jesse. He has my bags, so stay tuned for my Versace unboxing. If you guys come here, make sure to ask for Jesse, the Shops at Crystals at Versace. Next is Dior. So I finally got to see the new handbag that just came out this year. It's the 9522 bag, and I'll talk about it more after these few clips. So some matte 30 Montaigne's. 30 Montaigne is a great crossbody bag. This one is the new 30 Montaigne East West bag. So just like the Bobby, but it's going to be East West 30 Montaigne. So here's more of the new handbag. This handbag is called 9522. The reason why it's called 9522 because in 1995, that is when the first Lady Dior ever came out. And 22 for year 2022. And I think it's really nice. It's like a modern twist to the Lady Dior. There's going to be three sizes. There's small, medium, and large. And the small one is the black one. The medium is the white. There's also the size large, which is all the way on top. But it's really nice that the handbag comes with a strap as well. So you can wear it cross body. And the medium has a really cool like closure on the inside. So it's really different. And also this handbag, the handles on the handbag, they actually sit right in the middle, just like the black one right there. They do not stand up just like the regular Lady Dior's, like mini medium so yeah it's really different and also the material it isn't lambskin it's actually calf skin so if anybody is scared of like scratching their handbags dior has calf skin in the new handbag now so i think this is a great option it is definitely more pricier i believe the small is already around six thousand so that's kind of a price reference for you guys i don't remember the exact price because it isn't available online yet but currently they only have black and white so size small medium and large and everything comes with a strap it's actually really beautiful 
I would definitely will say it is a little bit on the heavier side just because it's like cow skin, it's thicker, and the 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 handle is a bit heavier. So yeah, because since it is metal, but I think it's really nice that Dior came out with a new handbag. It's very iconic, very different, and I think it's really cool that they made a new thing, you know, and the name is cool too, 9522. Like it just sounds perfect. So yeah, and here is the bottom of the handbag, the feet. There's going to be six feet, which I think is so cool. And this handbag kind of makes me, uh, reminds me of the Diorismo handbag, which I do have one. So it's similar in ways. So yeah, I was just seeing like, how heavy it was it's not too bad but if you are afraid of your handbag being too heavy then i recommend the small size but overall i do think the small sm the small size is a perfect size for me i really love the small one because it kind of is like the abc small handbag and here is how it looks on me crossbody i actually really like it a lot um i didn't expect to like want it so maybe in the future if they had like newer designs so yeah the handles are in the middle it's not standing up the strap is like thicker on the shoulder and then thinner when it goes down and then we have some smaller handbags micro lady dior dior amour phone holder which is the valentine's day collection and finally trying on the jadior bracelets is fashion jewelry my best friend and i we always get two each year so we decided to get the uh, burgundy one. I was looking at the green yellow one, but then it wouldn't make sense to get that because then it's not really matching. See, we had the beige one already and now we're getting the burgundy. So I'm going to show you guys some of the ready to wear pieces. I actually kind of like this coat. I really love the buttons on there with that like ship anchor. I think it's really cool. And just walking around similar things i've seen already because i do go to the boutique quite often so some things i already seen ready to wear pieces from the dior cruise collection wave number two some sweaters t-shirts and i love this jacket i need something like that hint hint wink wink <laughs> and i really love this dress so it's an oblique dress however it's sleeveless i don't really like to wear too many things that are sleeveless so we will have to see in the future when i do try it on my ootd i'm wearing all yes style my code is trish bear five for up to five percent off i'll link it down below and my shoes are from dior of course and then some dior men's kind of the same thing we already saw last time the collaboration with erl and then we have some sneakers you guys know the drill low top high top sneakers i love those baby blue ones and then we just have some more like backpacks and some handbags and then my essay also gave us some red envelopes thank you to nadia she is the best make sure to ask for her when you guys come to the shops of crystals after that we headed over to bulgari and i was just looking at some of the handbags these are like their exotics and it's just so stunning this red one right here, you can actually take out the snake head and wear it as a necklace. So I think that's really cool that you're able to take it apart. And they have, I think this was lizard, krung something. I forgot you guys, but I think I think it's really really beautiful. And I love like the coloring on it. And we have another one, the serpent tea. It's very very beautiful. I don't have any bulgari handbags because you guys know I'm a Dior lover, but we never know maybe i am eyeing like the micro bags because i think they're really cute and i love micro bags and my essay cory wanted to show us something really special this is a really limited edition piece i believe there are currently only seven in the u.s so it is very rare and very limited so if you guys do want this then make sure to contact my essay cory so this one is stingray so I think that's really unique because you, you never really see Stingray at all in like luxury handbags. Mostly you see like alligator, crocodile, ostrich, lizard, snakeskin. But this is my first time ever seeing Stingray. So it's really cool and very different. So it has like the serpentine and I believe the handle is stainless steel. But it the handbag, it is coated with 24K uh, carat. So I think that's very, very cool and very beautiful. And I am modeling 
it on me. I think it's really cute. It's like a little like tote bag. Um, it isn't too too heavy because of the handle, but I think it's really nice and very different. And because it is Lunar New Year, she also gave us some treats. And I didn't. I only tried one, which is the candy, because I tried the candy before, and I had it when I was younger. So it brought back a lot of memories. But just some Lunar New Year snacks, some like sesame balls. And then I saw this watch I wanted to try on. I think Bulgari has some very stunning watches. I definitely love the Serpenti watch, uh, but I don't plan on getting it anytime soon since I do have a watch right now. But I think if I were to get Bulgari, something next on my list would be like a B0 earring or a necklace in yellow gold. Um, but I do love the Bulgari Bulgari collection too, which I will show you guys in a moment. But this watch is really beautiful. And then these other cases with the Bulgari Bulgari collection, and necklaces, earrings, rings, bracelets. I love that necklace there. And yeah, just all really, really stunning and so, so beautiful. I love Bulgari jewelry. So here are the two bracelets, you guys. I just love Bulgari bangles. So this one is Carnelian and Mother Pearl, and the other one is Onyx and Diamond. And this collection is going to be all rose gold. You guys know that I'm a yellow gold lover now, but if I love a piece, I do not mind if it's in rose gold. But I definitely do not consider getting white gold anymore. I just am not a huge fan of white gold. So trying it on with my stack. This bracelet, the, the side that has carnelian, you can turn it around and it will be mother of pearl. So I think that's really cool. You can wear like mother of pearl, mother of pearl, or mother of pearl and carnelian. I think it's really beautiful and it pops since it's like a red color. And yeah, I really love it. This one is definitely on my list. I love Bulgari bangles. And then my friend, Madame, she also tried it on. I think it looks so nice on her. She needs to add a Bulgari piece to her bracelet stack. And then she also tried on these other pieces too. And it's carnelian. The other one is malachite. Um, this is actually size small, so she's going to need a size medium, but it still looks perfect on her wrist. And then we headed over to Burberry, and I was just looking at some of the ready-to-wear pieces. I said hi to my essay, and yeah, it's really nice in there, and she gave us some red envelopes, which was so, so nice of her. And that's in today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!